Happy Small Business Saturday. Today is near and dear to our hearts here at Mod Assistance because we spend every day of the year supporting small businesses and small business owners with our personal and virtual assistant services. If you clicked on this video, it is likely important to you as well to support these business owners, especially during the holiday season. If you are looking for ways outside of making a purchase to support these businesses, today we're talking about five free ways to support the local businesses in your area for Small Business Saturday. are new here, my name is Jacqueline Poole with Mod Assistance. We are household management and business admin experts, and on this channel, we take the years of experience from our team of personal and virtual assistants to help you within your home and your business. And welcome back to our 30 days of holiday prep. For the next 30 days leading up to Christmas Eve, we will be posting every day on our channel to help you with all of the holiday preparation that you could possibly need. So be sure to like this video and subscribe to the channel so you can keep up with all of our daily postings. If you are new to Small Business Saturday, let's start off with what it is. Small Business Saturday was started back in 2010 by American Express, and it is a day for us to celebrate and support the small businesses in our local area. It comes at a really important time, the day after Black Friday and the start of the holiday shopping season, because this is a very important season for so many small businesses. This is when a lot of the revenue comes in for their entire year. So yes, Black Friday deals are absolutely fun to shop and take advantage of, but we love this Saturday to remind us to support the businesses right down the street from us that need our support even more than the large corporation. According to the 2022 Small Business Saturday Consumer Insights Survey commissioned by American Express, it was reported that spending among U.S. consumers who shopped at independent retailers and restaurants on Small Business Saturday reached an estimated $17.9 billion. And this year, it is likely to grow even more. And as we've been saying for the past several years, this year is more important than ever for these small retailers still trying to gain exposure and get back to where they were pre-pandemic. But it is not all about the dollar. If you are looking for ways to support these small businesses without spending money, let's talk about five ways that could truly help them, but is completely free to you. First, and likely one of the most important ways to support local businesses for free is to write an online review. As we all know in today's age, when we are looking for a place to shop, a place to eat, when we are looking for a local business, we go to the internet. We go to Google or other search engines to see what is around us and what other patrons of that business are saying. So online reviews are huge. Of course, this is only going to be applicable if you have visited the local business, have been a customer of theirs, so that you can give an honest review. But if you did love your experience with this business, take just a few minutes out of your day to go online and write a review. This could be done on Google, on Yelp, on Facebook, on any of the major sites that you are likely to go to when you are searching for a small business. The review does not have to be long and it does not have to be in depth. All it needs to be is your honest thoughts on the business and be sure to give them five stars. Not three, not four, five stars will absolutely do the best. Outside of online search engines, where do you go when you're looking for information about a local business? You likely turn to social media. Any of the social media outlets, depending on where you as a person like to interact. So keep that in mind when you're looking to support these local businesses. On their social media sites, be sure to follow them. 
Be sure to like and engage with their posts, whether that be commenting or sharing. Any kind of interaction goes really far when it comes to this business reaching new potential customers. If you really want to take it a step further, sharing what the business posts onto your individual pages is the absolute best way to get the word out for that business. That way, your followers on your pages see this small business and it is likely people that they have not been able to reach yet. And of course, this is completely free to do, just takes a few minutes of your time and goes such a long way for those local businesses. Now, if any kind of online activity or digital presence isn't necessarily your thing, traditional word of mouth is still so important for small businesses. Again, if you think about when you're searching for a new business to interact with in your area, Yes, you might go to an online review, but you might also just ask your friends and family. Ask the people around you. Hey, what is the hair salon that you like to visit? Hey, have you used a contractor recently that you were really impressed with? This word of mouth, this referral from people that you actually know goes so much further than anything that you would ever read on the internet. So it is just as important to use word of mouth as it is to have a digital presence. So keep in mind some of your favorite businesses that you've had great experiences with. And if it ever comes up in conversation, don't hesitate to bring up that business and talk about your experience. You never know who's listening if they are looking for whatever business you're talking about and that could likely lead to a new customer for some of your favorite local businesses. This is kind of a fun one. And that is to actively wear and use the swag that is available from your favorite local businesses. Over the last several years, we have been seeing more and more local businesses create swag items featuring their logo for their customers to purchase or have for free as a way to promote their business out in their local area. So if you have been given or have purchased in the past an item featuring your favorite local business's logo, whether that be a t-shirt or a sweatshirt, a magnet that you keep on your fridge, or a calendar that you put on your wall in your kitchen, where your neighbors, friends, and families might see it when they come into your home. This seems like such a small thing to do, but really does go a far way. This helps with the business's brand recognition and awareness in the local area, and is a very free and easy way for you to promote a business without really having to do anything. So be sure to ask your favorite local businesses if they have any merchandise that you could purchase or have to keep in your home or wear on your body to help promote them and help bring awareness to their brand. And last but not least, we have a really easy one for you. And that is as simple as going to the business's website. Bringing traffic to their website will help that business in the search engines and it will help them get to the top so they are easily found by others looking for their business. It is as simple as that. No need to go anywhere else, but simply look them up on a search engine, click on their website, and spend a few minutes going through the different pages, maybe reading some of their content. The more time you spend on the website, the better. This doesn't mean you have to sit on the website for 20 minutes, but even spending two to three minutes clicking around and reading through some of their content really does help them, and it is a completely free and easy way to do it. If you are interested in learning more about Small Business Saturday, we will have some links below in the description box so that you can click through and find out even more ways to support the businesses in your area every day of the year, but especially today on Small Business Saturday. We hope you are enjoying our 30 days to holiday prep so far. We will leave the playlist linked up below and below in the description box if you'd like to watch back through all of our content. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel and check back here every day for a new video helping to get you ready for the holiday season. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye.